All right, well, welcome. Good morning. Thanks, Jesse, for being here with me today. I'm Acacia Pangelinan, the Executive Director of the Kamloops Chamber of Commerce. And with me is the premier sponsor of the Business Excellence Awards Program, MNP. We have Jesse Sra, who is a senior manager with MNP, who is going to just chat with us today a bit about the importance of the awards program. Um, we're right near the tail end of our nominations period, and we'd love to see more businesses get recognized. So um, Jesse, why does M&P support the Business Excellence Awards? Um, I think just being able for M&P, we're a firm that's always believed in supporting the communities where we serve. And so Kamloops is a fairly new community for us. We're fairly new to this um, region. And so when the opportunity came up for us to be able to um, you know, sponsor these awards, it was a great way to um, gain some brand recognition, but also be able to work with local businesses and um, get to know the local businesses and support, you know, an award that recognizes excellence. And I think we're a firm that believes in being excellent in, in the way that we work with our clients. And so, yeah, I think it's just a great award and a great opportunity for us. Awesome. And we absolutely appreciate your support. This is your second year now being the premier sponsor of the awards. And uh, we had a blast last year ringing in the roaring 20s at our gala in October. Um, but with everything going on right now, why is it important to recognize businesses? Um, I just, I think it's, a difficult, it's been a difficult um, couple of months for a lot of businesses. Businesses are struggling, um, you know, they've had to close even in some way, shape or form. And so um, this, it, it just provides some type of a bright light or something to look forward um, for these businesses. I mean, um, getting nominated in a category might provide you with that little bit of um, a glimmer to keep you going and get through this difficult time. And so it's just nice, nice to be able to provide something encouraging in a time where the future is unknown for a lot of businesses and their staff. And so um, I think more than any other year before, I think these, these awards are really important. I absolutely agree. You know, the last couple months have really felt like businesses have been beat up. And so this is a really nice way of recognizing the hard work of people in our community. And you kind of touched on this, but um, what can a nomination do for a company? Um, you know, I, I think it encourages businesses. Um, it shows them that what they're doing is, you know, it's being recognized by other people outside of themselves and their hard work is kind of paying off. Um, it also encourages their employees, you know, to continue to work to support the businesses and, and keep doing the great work that they're doing. Um, it also, like I said, it provides brand recognitions. Um, you know, maybe a customer is more likely to choose a particular business if they know they've been nominated or they've won an award. Um, you know, it also provides you with a great little plaque that you can put up in your office to show your customers that, you know, you're doing great work in, in one of the categories, one of the many categories that there are in these awards. Absolutely. And, um, you know, we're right, we have two weeks left, I think a little bit less than that to have businesses get nominated. Um, so how would you encourage businesses to get nominated? What, what would you give them as advice? Um, I think just, just speaking with your clients, speaking with your customers, even your staff, um, just recognizing, you know, are they happy with your service? Um, are you supporting your staff in a, in a way that's over and above um, what they would expect? Let them know about the awards um, and what it would mean for you and your business to get nominated in one of the categories. Um, I think another thing is, you know, if you recognize that there's a business out there that's doing excellent work, um, in the community, then go ahead and nominate that business. You know, um, as a business owner being nominated, they would recognize what that means for them. And, you know, they might go out and nominate another business that they think is, um, is doing excellent work and you might be the recipient of that nomination. So um, I think it's, it's just a great way to support one another. Um, a lot of businesses, it's a small community, a lot of business owners know one another. And so they know the great work that they're doing um, with their with their business. So I think it's just a great way of encouraging one another um, and and building that peer to peer support. You, you really hit the nail on the head. Kamloops is such a tight knit small community. Um, and in the sense that we we often work together and, and so we succeed together and we encourage one another. And so, um, you know, at the chamber, we see lots of nominations from one company nominating another company because they work with them throughout the year and, and really realize that they deserve the recognition. So um, final question for you this morning, why are the Business Excellence Awards important in the community? 
Uh, I think it just allows communities to recognize businesses. You know, you might not work with every single business, but it allows you to recognize the businesses that are doing great work um, in their business and in their community. Um, I think especially now with COVID and everything that's going on, I think we all know one or more businesses that are doing something to support, you know, the frontline workers, are doing something to help, you know, um, the people that are impacted by COVID the most, um, you know, that are pivoting their businesses and their operations. Um, I Even in terms of like producing PPE, all of that is allowing businesses to reopen in a manner that's safe for their customers and for their staff. And so doing things like that, I think is going over and above um, your business category. And I think it's, it's showing that you're, you're doing smart business. And I think that's something that needs to get recognized. And I think the community is really going to be um, behind businesses that are doing that type of work, especially in a time like now. I totally agree with you. And I think that, you know, a nomination in the Business Excellence Awards is kind of like a, I'm choosing it like a call to action. If you want to support and, and recognize businesses that maybe you've gone to for a long time and they may be in jeopardy or they may have had struggles, like now more than ever is a great time to ha have them receive some recognition. So sure, thanks yeah. so much, Jesse, for joining me this morning. I think that's all the questions I have. Uh, just a reminder that the Business Excellence Awards nominations close on May 31st. So we have about 10 days left to get your nominations in. Thank you and uh, have a great day. Thanks, Acacia.